Hello everybody and welcome. I am the Occasionally Clever Gamer and today we are playing a little bit of Lairs of Fear. The marathon continues. That is not actually part of the title of Lairs of Fear. That is just sort of what I'm saying because I'm trying to get this level done. I said this morning, man, I'm going to get up and record another level. It's going to be lots of fun. No, instead of being scared out of my wits end and I'm doing way more time than I usually do on Lairs of Fear. Uh, because this thing, this game literally terrifies me. Look, there's a baby looking at me. Why is, why the heck is there a baby there? 853. Okay, well, we're going to dial 853. Hopefully, to order a delicious pizza. But I'm assuming not, because this game would not be that awesome. Oh, good. Oh, good. 853. Oh my goodness, I'm the one who's setting the clues. Look, because I was right there. Look, there's Creepy Baby. Oh, I'm setting my own clues. This, this is messing me up, man. Get out of here. Uh. It solves nothing. It never has. It never will. It never will. Okay. Good. Good. Apparently someone has remembered to turn on gravity again. Kind of annoying. Hello? Hello, baby face? Okay, well, what are we supposed to be doing right now, huh? I can't dial this phone. So I guess we're going back the other way? Ah! Ah, what are you doing here? What are you looking at? Ah, ha, stupid baby. That's why you don't sit there. Uh, 354. Cool, let's see if we can dial on this phone even though it's upside down. Oh, it's not. Oh, that's that disappoints me a little. Three. Five. Four. Ring-a-ding-ding. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh! Remind me to fire the man who made this. Every time... Friggin' terrible. That guy is super bad at phones. Well, listen, I guess I'm going down with it. Come on. Sixth time. Sixth time this episode. Well, sixth time this level, we've been knocked out cold. Uh, and the only reason I jumped off was because I was pretty certain we were supposed to do that. Man, I think that prosthetic leg we got is made of, like, adamantium. Because it has taken them heavy beating. First, there was that tiger trap the mouse set for us. Baby face. Uh... And now, we just fell from an enormous height. You deserve this. All of it. All really? <laughs> really? Oh no, oh no. Don't come through the door, ghost lady. Okay, it's cool. Ghost lady isn't coming through. Oh no, that's more ectoplasm. That is only, only produced by, of course, the most angry of ghosts. Well, let's just keep opening up these drawers. Baby face. What, what was that knocking noise? Okay. Uh, right now I am going to... Okay, our liquor cabinet's fine. Okay, I don't see anything... Yeah, no, I don't see anything bad here. Okay, let's just, I guess, head out. Man. All I want to do is finish this bloody level. Oh, uh, why is that so hard? Okay. So what else around here do we need? Um, those are all lame. Lame. Before it was like the entrance to the secret tunnel was given away by a mysterious book. Is there one such mysterious fuzzy blurring book? No, there's not. So we've got baby face. Uh, we've got, of course, our lights. We've got a cabinet. We can't close despite... I needed something to add oh. the... Oh, no. I what? 
final touches. A finger. I needed a finger. Chopped it off. Easier than sawing a leg. Washed it. Dried it in an oven. Fell asleep. Almost burned it. Will I manage what? to pull this off? What are you doing? So, wait, did we cut off one of our own fingers, dry it in the oven for a painting? And also, why was it inside our telephone? Well, wait, see, what did they say? Tri trial and error. Oh, good. Oh, good, we only have so many fingers to trial and error, though. Uh, you crazy sign. Okay, so now we get to return to the studio. Oh, the studio is full of ectoplasm. We've lost... Our childlike design. What's going to be in the chest now? Not babies, it's just empty. Still locked. Wait. Oh, I guess that would still be locked. Because we have to apply another layer of paint. Okay. So it's shifting. It's becoming more than it once was. Uh, it is now... Oh, we're painting our dead wife, ain't we? Good, good, good. We're painting our dead wife. Okay, well, we've lost the cabinet door for this. Guess the repo men came by. Uh, oh, that is... Oh, now I'm upset. See, they're using different china for the different items. Why... Like, why not reuse the asset? Why not bring that down? Who has more than one set of, like... Uh, who has more than one set of china in their house? Okay, well, whatever. We finished up uh, the... We have one level left to go. And we have, we're have we only six minutes into the episode. So it looks like we're trying another one. Okay, we're moving on. Last level. Possibly the scariest. No stops pulled. We still haven't seen a dog level. So I'm happy with that. Okay, so one direction we have no door. The other direction. We do have a door. Let's go no door. No door. Okay, no matter what, we're going to the same spot, right? Also, this way I can start running if anything scares me. I'll just run back to the other room and... Nope, this is where I live. Oh, wow. See, now I'm onto this game's tricks. I know exactly where I am. See, that was the way we just went. That's the studio. That's the unknown door. Let's see, can we go back to the studio? Yes, yeah, these studios locked. I got this game figured out. Uh, unfortunately, we did also do a loop. Oh my goodness. Are we going back to the kitchen? It's been such a long time. Look, sugar, oregano. Oh my gosh, this is our, this is our kitchen. More paprika. Oh, all, all this guy has is paprika and oregano and a little bit of sugar. Oh, I miss this. I miss Sauce Simulator 2016. They've gotten the sauce making ready for us. Look look at all these. We just mush these up with our feet. Mm -mm -mm, delicious. Squish, squish, squish. And we got ourselves a sauce. That's actually a terrible idea. Do not squish, squish, squish and got yourself a sauce. Okay, well, sauce simulator already done. I'm just trying to speed rush it at this point. I'm not even bothering with commentary. I'm just, I'm just commenting on weird ectoplasm, that paint and dry. If you guys are painters out there, here's a little hint from another creative soul. Here's another hint from a creative soul. No, no. No. You stay closed. You stay closed. You do not get to open up again. Okay. Oh, the paint did dry. The paint dried in some sort of hellscape. Oh, good. Oh, good. Now this painting is of some creepy demonic child. Um, I think I've seen this painting before. Isn't this the one that tried to attack us earlier? So maybe he's going to try to attack us again. When we open this door, it's going to be right on the other side. It's going to be super terrifying. Okay. Oh, no, never mind. We're good. It's still there. I thought it was going to attack us. Okay. I did find it kind of funny, though, how that door opened up again. Okay, so we got this painting on all sides. Okay. 
We got this panda on all sides, and we got rats. Well, let's just get this over with. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. That was less terrifying than... Oh, that's going to be... This, this is getting more and more terrifying. I thought it was going to be really bad, but then the lights came back on. I was like, oh, sweet. I can see now. But no, no, it's still dark. It's still dark, and I'm looking behind me. Okay. No, we're good. Let's step on these paintings. Okay, these paintings are reacting poorly to my presence. Oh. Jeez. Okay, well, we have fire. Uh, an annoying, annoying high-pitched noise. Plenty of rats. Listen, my ratty friends, it's okay. Stay calm. Form a nice, orderly line out the main door. Okay, now apparently they evac well enough on their own without me. Uh, so we have a couple of options. We can try to go through this door here, or what I'm gonna do will be sneaky. And I'm gonna have. Oh shoot, there's crying on the other side of this door. Maybe I should go out the other side. No, no, we're going this side. Help a friend in need. Hello? Hello, crying woman. I'm going to assume you're the creepy lady who has been attacked. Oh, Frig. The rats are bringing her to us. The rats are bringing her to us. It's okay. Guys, it's gonna be okay. We're gonna close that door. There we go. We're gonna cross over to this side and we are not, we're not turning around. We're not turning around. We're just walking this way. We just played right into the game's filthy hands in. We, we should have attacked that person. We're turning around. Oh shoot, no, it's locked. That was super creepy. I'm I'm positive those rats were carrying that person towards us. Oh frig, I I don't like this game. Oh, okay. We're doing the tactical. We're gonna slice the pie, people. From now on, that is going to be our motto whenever we come around a corner. Slice the pie. Okay, guys. Uh, okay. So I'm going to give everyone a little step-by-step -step guide on how to slice the pie. What you do is you throw open the door, you toss in a flashbang, and then you go clear by sector. Um, I actually did hold up my hands like I was holding a gun to do the clear by sector. But of course you guys can't see me. Boom. Slice the pie. Slice the pie. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. What is this out here? Oh my goodness. This looks like the courtyard I was looking at earlier in the game. Except now it's covered in ectoplasma. Don't. Look. Back. Guys, we're looking back. Oh shoot, now looking back is looking forwards. Are we allowed to look forwards? We're looking forwards. Okay, no, we're looking forwards, it's fine. The game's giving us these warnings. Oh, oh, the ectoplasma is squishy. Okay, guys. Okay. Get ready to slice the pie. Slice the pie, pew, pew, pew. Okay, we tried slicing the pie and it did not work out. And it's just full of, oh no, there's ectoplasma mixed with paint. This is just, see this thing right here, this is creepily bright. It's too bright. Each mistake a pitfall. Oh good, get it, cause there's a pitfall right here. It's dark. Guys, I'm gonna need a flashbang to toss in here. Uh, hello, base camp. Can I get a flashbang? Okay, whatever. Uh, before I jump in, I am going to say thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe. Like if you like what you see. Subscribe if you want to see more of me being frightened out of my skin. I did, of course, forget to have my webcam going, which kind of sucks. But whatever, I refuse to go back and do redos, especially in this game because you literally can't. Uh, your progress is saved constantly, and yeah, I there's no way for me to go back rooms. So that kind of sucks. I'll try to remember to do it next uh, recording session, but this is like literally four weeks that I've just done, so it's gonna be a while. Probably gonna forget by that time, and I probably I look terrible anyways. I look terrible. You guys don't want to see my face. You much prefer to hear me go ee ah woo whenever stuff scares me. Uh, but I don't, uh, man. Okay. Wait, what did, where, where was I going with this? I don't even remember where I was going. 
What I am going to say, though, is goodbye. Oh, this is so creepy. Okay, but we're staying near Grandmama Lamp. Come, come, Grandmama Lamp. Keep off the demons. I'm just glad I figured this out, because I'm pretty sure if I hadn't have figured this out, if I hadn't been obsessed with creating random characters out of nothing, I... Uh, no. Grandma, my lap. 